Hey everybody, Joshua here on the YouTubes and today we're going out on a land tour for some out-of-state clients from Wisconsin and I wanted to take you along for the ride so you can see uh, what I do and how I do it. Um, and also at the end of this video I'm going to attach the actual video that I'm filming for them in the process so you can kind of see what that looks like. In case you're thinking about buying land in Asheville, you can contact me anytime. My information is down below. You can call, email, or text me anytime. Other than that, come on along. So when a client contacts me, they generally give me some basic information about what they're looking for. How many acres, how, what's the price point, how far from Asheville, that sort of thing. So I want to dig a little deeper uh, so I can get a vision of what's in their head as far as when they walk out on their front porch, this is what we want to see. So uh, I ask a lot of questions. Um, how close is it to a main road? How far down a dirt road can it be? Um, is it cleared? Is it forested? Can it be steep? Does it have to be flat? Um, are neighbors really close or are neighbors far away? And can neighbors be close if they wanted to build close? Um, what are you going to be using it for? What are the features of the property like creek, long range view, that sort of thing? And also what type of house are you going to build? Uh, once I have that stuff narrowed down, I can kind of take a look and see what's out there. A little difficult right now, inventory is low, so uh, we had to search uh, far and wide to find something, but I think I found them something. So they are looking for five unrestricted acres-ish, uh, up to 150,000, uh, with views uh, within 20 miles of Asheville, easy access to road, main road, uh, creek preferable, uh, large trees, and they're looking to build a second home to eventually retire here. And they're looking for four seasons, which Asheville has, but they're sick of the winters up in Wisconsin. So now that I know what they're looking for, I found them a piece of property, a little less acreage than they want, but the price is good. Um, been on the market for a, a little bit, so we might be able to negotiate. Um, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna call up the agent let them know we're coming, see if they can give us any more information. You never want to show up on a property unannounced. A lot of people like to do drive-bys of property and land and uh, neighbors and uh, landowners get a little upset about that. So we got our MLS here, which is going to have all our information, backup directions in case the phone's not working. Uh, we got our survey here. And although I do most of my walking around on land from an app on my phone, um, that's a backup just in case the uh, phone's not working or dead. Um, you can use uh, apps like uh, LandGlide. Um, HomeSnap works really well as well. Um, HomeSnap is actually virtual reality, so if you're holding up your phone, it'll actually show you the uh, property line in that view. Um, the other thing I'm going to bring is my video camera. My regular camera to take more details of the property, you know, close-ups of the trees or long-range views or different uh, areas. Um, and then I'm going to bring warm clothes. We're up at about 3,500 feet today. It's going to be about uh, probably 25, 30 degrees up there. So warm clothes, boots, snowed a couple days ago. Other than that, uh, I think we're ready to go and I'll see you out there. All right guys, so right at the beginning of the property here, um, first thing I'm looking for is anything that will um, exclude this uh, more than include it. So uh, they're looking for uh, access, which was good. As you see on the video, um, good gravel drive going up. We're only about half a mile from the main road. Um, the trees look big and nice. A um, couple just right at the, we're at the uh, beginning at the bottom corner of the land, but uh, a couple nice building spots already. And as you can see, a beautiful view. All right, so here we are at the top of the property. A little out of breath, it's pretty steep coming up, but things I'm looking for, possible build sites. There's a couple down below. Up top, as you can see, it's a little steeper. Um, goes all the way up to the ridge line there. Doesn't look like there's any problem with the property lines. From what I can see, obviously you always wanna get a survey, but you know, Perfect piece of property for them. Great views, old hardwoods, easy access. Again, the uh, video will be attached above and probably at the end of the video. So this is what we can do if you're out of town. Feel free to contact me anytime. My information's down below. Thanks for coming along.